Hello, my friends. My name is E. How are you all doing today? Alrighty then. Today, instead of doing the normal Let's Play style of videos, we're going to be doing a video on leadership. And now we've all followed good leaders and bad leaders in the past. George Washington, Adolf Hitler, etc. But today, I want to talk about the type of leader I'd follow. And in the comments, I'd like to see the type of leader you guys follow. My opinion of a good leader is a man who is assertive, influential, and righteous to the core. A man who can lead others to battle. A man who can influence others to stand up for their beliefs. A man who has honor and integrity. A great example for an assertive leader would be Jack Black in the movie School of Rock, when he teaches his class to stick it to the man and to stand up for what they want in life. Who? The man! Oh, you don't know the man? Oh, well, he's everywhere! In the White House, down the hall, Miss Mullins, she's the man. And the man ruined the ozone, and he's burning down the Amazon, and he kidnapped Shamu and put her in a chlorine tank, okay? And there used to be a way to stick it to the man. It was called rock and roll. And if I was gonna give you a grade, I would give you an A. But that's the problem. Rock ain't about doing things perfect. Who can tell me what it's really about? Leonard. Sticking it to the man? Yes. But you can't just say it, man. You gotta feel it in your blood and guts. If you wanna rock, you gotta break the rules. You gotta get mad at the man. And right now, I'm the man. That's right, I'm the man. And who's got the guts to tell me off? Huh? Who's gonna tell me off? A great example for an influential leader would be Ronnie James Dio. He has inspired countless metal bands to form together and to fight the evil forces of MTV. Not only that, but he is the one man to equip us with the ultimate hand gesture, the heavy metal devil horns. And even though Dio is no longer with us today, he will always be remembered in our hearts for being one of the greatest metal influences of all time. Rest in peace, Dio. Or should I say, rock in peace. Jables, you are hungry for the rock, but to learn the ancient methods, secret doors you must unlock. Escape your father's clutches in this oppressive neighborhood. On a journey you must go to find the land of the heart. In the city of fallen angels, where the ocean meets the sand, you will form a strong alliance and the world's most awesome brand. To find your fame and fortune through the valley you must walk, you will face your inner demons. Now go, my son, and Now, before I reveal my example for righteousness, I must say it took me some time to come up with this one. There were a lot of choices to choose from, but I couldn't have thought of anyone much more qualified than the frontman of Megadeth, Dave Mustaine. Last week in my own house, it's four in the morning. Dave Mustaine is the kind of person that will not take no for an answer. He will stop at nothing to get what he wants. He has his own share of political opinions. And he is certainly not afraid to share those opinions with the public and his fans. If you don't vote, you're not heard, you're not seen, you're invisible. Invisible, 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 invisible. Anywho, that's all I have for today, my friends. Thanks for joining me. I'd like to remind you to put a comment in the description on who you follow as a leader in life. Thanks for joining me. My name is Z, and I am out. Boop!